Hi everyone, welcome back and uh, I'm here as usual on my Webkins account and I'm just just here to have a little bit of fun just horse around and you know just make the best of whatever the day is going to be so I'm actually starting out in my little kin's polar bears room this is Gideon he is my little kin's polar bear and yeah he lives in a nice looking room. The decor of this room hasn't changed terribly much since I actually opened this account sometime in August of 2007. Gideon is one of my original pets and he's actually named after my great great uncle Gideon. So yeah, I actually have a great great uncle Gideon. Well he's dead now but I had a great great uncle Gideon and that's who my polar bear is named after. So yeah. He's a pretty stylish little fellow. This is his room. Um, there are some retired objects in this room, as you can see. The super bed that he is sleeping on is a retired super bed. And over here is probably one of my favorite retired items and the only one like it that I have, my green lava lamp. So I'm really lucky to have that. And I'm not getting rid of that, so don't even ask if it's for trade. Nothing that you see is for trade of any sort. So with that being said, we're just going to hang out and uh, do some things today and uh, see what all we can do. If we go to the Kinsville map, then we can actually work on our marshmallow collection. So I have a big bunch of people I can actually ask for help with uh, giving me marshmallows for my marshmallow collection. So we're gonna to try to complete some of that today if we possibly could. And, mm-hmm. Awesome, our map is opening as you can clearly see. So yeah, that is like really, really cool. <laughs> now, for the most part, my map has looked like this ever since I got my account back uh, as of February of 2014. Yeah, um, like many of you guys who came back to Webkins, you know, for whatever reason, I had to get my account unlocked from archives, so I did. And the end result is, as you see, I'm actually on my second round of marshmallow collecting for this account. I actually already got the grand prize and all the other items once already. So we're just going to go ahead and zoom down the line. Dum, 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 dum. Uh, go up just a little bit. Aha, this will be fine. I have some friends, a lot of friends who can give me some help. Mm-hmm, I think. Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Excellent. There we go, that part's done. Mm-hmm. Oh, if you can hear that noise, just excuse it, that's our bird clock going downstairs. I like to try to identify the pets who are also on the map. I may not remember all of who's who, but uh, there is my magical, mystical hedgehog. That's not Sherilyn. Sherilyn's the other one that I have. I don't remember what I named her, <laughs> unfortunately. And there's one of my little kin's pigs. That's either Percy, Priscilla, or Petunia. That, this is my uh, curly lion, or lioness, I should say. Her name's Melissa Jane. And who is the other pet? That, that might be, that might be Max, my little kin's black poodle. He looks kind of tiny, so that might be Max, my little kin's black poodle. I have a, yep, that's Max. And then uh, the other poodle who lives with him is a little kin's pink poodle named Maggie. And uh, when I actually opened my account a long time ago, some of the earliest pets I adopted were three little kin's pigs. 
Percy, Priscilla, and Petunia because I always wanted to say I actually have three little pigs. <laughs> so that's really cute. That's a little true fact about my account and why I have what I have and all that thing. So I have three little kins pigs. Yep, I have the three little pigs in my house. Mm hmm. Yep, like I said, the names are Percy, Priscilla, and Petunia. So that's all awesome. Waiting for the arcade to open. <laughs> I, I guess I kind of did this on purpose because Polar Plunge is the game of the day today. I didn't do uh, either the Wheel of Wow or Wishing Well 2. So I kind of wanted to get that part done. I wanted to show you guys basically what's considered to be considered your daily games. What your daily is what I'm actually doing. Oh, wow. Technically most pet sim games that I know of they have at least one or two regular things you do every single day and those are your dailies and all that stuff even just like spinning a prize wheel like you do on Animal Jam if, whether you remember or not doesn't matter so everyone can actually spin a wheel and win something you can either get you know well you know whatever but this is basically this is the real while on that can you spin this wheel and you can win a prize. So how awesome is that? Mm -hmm. I, I think I'm going to be getting an item prize. I don't... Then again, I don't know. This thing's going kind of pokey and slow. Maybe I'll get the pet medallion. Yes, I got the pet medallion for the tree frog. Oddly enough, I don't have a tree frog yet on this account. So if I'm lucky, I should be able to adopt a tree frog from the uh, medallion pets when I get down to that point. So that may actually end up being my very first uh, medallion pet. Well, technically my second because my first medallion pet was actually the kiwi. But I had some help with that because they released a uh, bundle of medallion <laughs> Um, during the Kiwi welcome party a few months ago, so I was actually able to adopt my very first Kiwi as a result of that. So, yeah, I have Broadway the Kiwi, and he is so cute. I adore him. We're gonna spin the wheel for once. Do you go away? Sorry, guys, I have a little gap in my vacation. I've so often. I kind of killed a vibe a little bit. Oh, we're gonna get some money. Whatever. I don't care because money's money. Hey, we want 250 kids cash. Yeah, so we're just screwing around, playing games and all that other kind of fun stuff. So, you know, I just kind of wanted to make this what it was. Something simple, something fun. I might actually do a few other arcade games once I'm done with these because, you know, what the hell. You know. This was my original account, and I remember, you know, when it opened, I played buttloads of games. I, I I didn't really do much with the clubhouse or anything else like that. Back in those days, they didn't have the Kinsville Park and the Adventure Park. Those didn't really exist at the time. They came later. I never stuck around long enough to actually see those things be put together. But, you know, not in the middle though. Well, whatever. That's good. I'll take it. I can't complain. Actually, uh, not too long ago, I actually did get the wishing wells in the middle. That was fun. When you get them in the middle, you get the exclusive items. But if you get the three wells at the top of the bottom, you get the 1,000 kins cash. I think that's happened before too on another account. I mean, it was my nephew who got it there. My nephew has an account. So, yeah, so every so often, he might actually, you know, win something nice here and there. So, yeah. Webkins is a nice game to play, you know, as a family or extended family between friends. You know, it's, it's just fun. I mean, I'm still having fun. I mean, here I am. I'm like, what? 37. I'll be 38 in November and I still, I still get a kick out of this.
And to me, this is a fun game to play. Let's do, some, let's do one round of Cash Cow too. I can spend like all day playing this game. I really can. So let's go ahead and... Do remember that I do not use any fancy editing software on any videos that I do, so everything that happens is basically taking place just as you see it, so everything is recorded, not precisely. I, I just don't believe in fancy editing, I just, you know, I, I've seen edited, edited videos, some of them don't look all that great, you know, conversation is so good that the scene action jumps from scene to scene, and sometimes Maybe it's just me, but I find editing videos a lot harder to watch than if they were not edited. But again, maybe that's just me. I just never understood the purpose of editing all that much. But like I said, I'm my own person, so I do things that I want. But you know, that doesn't necessarily mean that I like We'll try to trap you guys from editing. If you want to do that, you know, more credit to you. So we'll just edit this We're going through cash counts here. Looking at all these things, we're like the bottles and stuff. I could spend a lot of time playing this fucking different game. This is this is probably my favorite game in the arcade to actually play. I don't think I have any other favorites at this point. But then again, I don't know. It is what it is. basically how that game ends. Now as this is my deluxe account, and you know that because, oops, let me just go right back to the arcade because I've actually been able to do the wheel with deluxe, so yeah, that's kind of how you can tell. Yeah, sorry, when I'm actually recording, sometimes my videos tend to lag an awful lot. So we're gonna do something else. Let's play Wacky Zingos. A lot of people like Wacky Zingos. I like Wacky Zingos. I think it's fun. <laughs> I usually don't score very high in it. And by the way, just, just ignore the background always. I have a very squeaky chair. Shoot. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I'm not going to do as well as this, with this game because of how bad my computer tends to do when I try to do things like this. <laughs> so, when I'm not recording, this, the speed is actually pretty normal. Uh, yeah, definitely not good. Whatever. Eh, I'm, 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 oh, I'm happy to do anything. So, anyway. <laughs> yeah. I just don't exactly have the greatest setup where my computer can go at a natural speed when I'm recording. <sighs> Well, it is what it is, I guess. Can't be all that bad, though, right? Hmm. All right. Hey, Flutterbugs. I haven't played this one in a while. Kind of, kind of, kind of fun. Yeah. <laughs> Don't 
follow me, God damn it. That's a surprise. disregard all that shit man like I say sometimes when I'm doing these games it gets like real laggy oh let's see what kind of notification I got mm -hmm. oh yeah someone wants a marshmallow there you go have a marshmallow on me put it in your cocoa mm -hmm. So anyway, let's see what else we can play. Yeah, Flood of Bark is kind of fun. Mm -hmm. uh, there's Go Go Googles. Like, I need to play this and get like a thousand points or whatever, so that way I can go on and finish just one thing at the Adventure Park or some shit like that. I don't know. Oh, there's Hungry, Hungry Hog. But uh, that's not the one I want to play, though. The one I want to actually play... It's, there we go, Pinky's Big Adventure. This is fun. I love this game. I love this game, even though I suck at it, but hey, whatever. <laughs> I love it. I'm actually going to turn this up so you can actually see or hear it a little bit more. So, there we go. Because the bees are so funny. <laughs> there we go. 
Pokemon. Thank <laughs> you. 
this time. this long honestly We're just gonna wrap it up here. I'm glad I got to play some games and show you guys how fun Webkins can actually be. Because yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Alright. We can just get back to our Gideon's room. And yeah, from there we can wrap things up. <laughs> Huh. <laughs> All right, there's my little polar bear dreaming away. I wonder what he's dreaming about. Well, I guess we'll never really know for sure. But all I can say is it's been fun, it's been real, and I'll see you guys another time. Bye, everyone. <laughs>